the camera. I'm sure you were. <clears throat> He's alive! <laughs> Was alive. Okay, just be a second while I pop my things around. Okay, so hi YouTube. You can see me, but I can't see you. Properly. Surprising, that. I can kind of see. Wait. If you could see them, that, that would be disturbing. Hello, YouTube! Now I can see! Put some clothes on! Yeah, put some clothes on, especially you. Anyway, so, unedited, again. Still here, should be going home soon. I'm gonna eat this biscuit. Wow, it's stale as fuck. It's been out all night. Okay, so, first things first, Chris's episode. Do you ever talk about anything that isn't CDs and films? Seriously? I mean, come on, compete with me here. Eat a biscuit. They're good. We even got a biscuit for you. I my biscuit. Anyway, so, mm, just be a minute. You're just going to sit there and eat your biscuit. I'm going to sit here and drink my drink. Sorry. Anyway. Unedited. Oh. So, what are we been up to? Um. We've been up to quite a few things. Oh, yeah. Um. Shop in Manchester. Let's talk about the shop in Manchester. It's the best shop ever. We found a shop that sells lots of retro things. Shelves and shelves of Pokemon. Shelves and Pokemon. Yes, and Nintendo games and NES games. Oh, I was in heaven. I've not seen a NES in so long and it's just so good. Like, ah, yeah. But everything in there costs a fortune, which mm. makes me sad. Yeah, I don't think I can afford 50 quid for... um games console when I'm struggling to even cover my rent. And I can't afford 40 quid for a talking new, as cool as that fucking is. It's okay. <coughs> <laughs> <Dun -dun. laughs> anyway, yeah, so we found this really cool shop in Manchester, which was pretty awesome. So that's one thing we did, we went to Manchester. Yeah, that was interesting. You don't like bus rides. And we were on the we bus. We caught one. like a million buses. Yeah. We saw Tom, James and Mike, which are like my old friend. You've probably seen them in like photos or I used to do comics and they were in there. But yeah, they, they were cool. cool. Cool to see them again. Yeah. yeah. Hey, James, Tom and Mike. James has just done around the trip world and Tom wouldn't tell us around what he's done. Around the trip world. Round the trip. <laughs> Let's all go around the trip. Woo! In the world. Yay. Anyway. Hey, my gun toe. Not anymore. Okay, so we've done that. Um, what else did we do? We found a little dormouse outside. That was pretty awesome. Called him Indy. Called it, yeah, we called him Indy. Well, my parents called him Jerry. We called him Indy. And we took care of him more, so. You've been feeding him. Yeah. He's probably still alive. He's probably in a bush. Probably. Probably in your bush. Nope. No mouse. Damn. Um, okay, yes. This is this is way too slow and normal for an editor. Yes, yes it is. Quick, throw things. <laughs> hey! That helped. That helped a lot. Fine. <laughs> so, um, other things. Um, I destroyed my arm, which is It begins moves again. Yeah, it's beginning to get better. It still hurts quite a bit. What happened was, is I used to do a lot of skateboarding when I was younger. And being the cocky twat that I am, I came back and thought, ooh, skateboard, I can give this a try, because why not? I'm probably still good at it. So I get on, I do a few things, I'm like, yeah, I've still got it. Then I slam a curb and fell forward like that and then destroyed my arm. With the most beautiful timing, just as he said, I really missed my skateboard, he literally missed his skateboard. Yeah. But hey, I got Tremadol. <laughs> Happy drippy times. It makes the pain go away. It would do it, the pain go. Yeah. 
So, yeah, that, that's cool. And I got a lot of Trevor dolls, so I'm very happy. I get lots of painkillers, and I might take one of them later because my arms begin to hurt because I slept on it again, and it's really not nice. And really I'm pretty sure it's not meant to feel like that when I do that. Like, all here is, like, going... You're okay. old. <laughs> I am not old. Pulled out another grey hair earlier. Shh! I'm not grey, look. I'm oh, no, it's not there anymore because I pulled it out. Okay, anyway, 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 no, anyway, anyway. Oh, my Jesus Christ. I've always wanted to show everyone at this. You're going to fork them all. Yes, I'm going to fuck you all, and this is my, um, this is my weapon of choice if zombies ever, ever invade. What are you so. going to do, eat them? No, I'm going to hit them, like, you know, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. It's kind of um, impractical because of this bit, makes it a little harder to swing, like, you're doing it like that, and you're like, oh, my nuts! Yeah, I can see how that would be somewhat counterproductive. It can go over the way. Guitar. Or you can just use it to eat really big things. It's my cake fork! Yes, anyway, as you can see, everything's still a little weird because I'm still coming down from Tremadol a bit. So, what time are we on? We're on six minutes! Already? Whoa! Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so let's move on. Okay, so we've done that, we've done that. Yeah. 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 Okay, um. I want to do random fat. Can we do random fat? Yes, do the fat. Okay, one minute. <laughs> ah, the random fact today from randomfactgenerator.net, yeah, I still go there, um, is a man gets robbed ev in London every 4.5 minutes and he gets fed up of it. This raises the question, is this the same man every time? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of worried about that. I mean, this poor guy's getting robbed. No one seems to be doing anything, but did you seem to interview him? And then rob him. So it's more of like a, hello sir, can you tell us how it is to always be robbed? It's Give us your money. I knew that was coming. Yeah, so it's kind of like it's that. It's alright, so you've got another four minutes before the next one. So yeah, there's um, that kind of stuff, so that that's kind of cool. Um, I know you, you want to talk about this, don't you? Yes, yes I do. Did want to talk about that. Okay, so uh, do you want to talk about it and I'll go stand near the thing? Yeah, sure, why not? Eternal Sonata. I've been playing this recently, I've been trying to play it a few times, couldn't get past the first cutscene because, in fairness, it's really fucking boring. But I've been getting into it a bit. But my problem with the game is it's basically a cutscene with a little bit of gameplay. It's not a game with cutscenes. Hey, no playing, you're cramping my style. Exactly, shut up Eternal Sonata, I will defeat you. But the combat system is the thing that really bugs me. Because special attacks, you get a load of different special attacks, but it only decides which ones you can use based on where you're standing. So, say you're standing next to the person you want to heal, but you can't heal them, so you think, ah, oh, fuck it, I'll go over and walk towards this dragon. Suddenly it decides, well, the only special attack you can use is healing. The only time you can attack this dragon is when you're standing nowhere near it. Are these dragons paying off the game designers or something? And why? Why in the hell? Does the baby dragon look like a koala with wings? Why are we meant to be scared of that? Aside from the fact that we can't attack it. Yes, this game has been frustrating me. A lot. Up, down, left, left, circle, triangle, square. Head, shoulders, knees and toes. Get up. Stop dying. Fine. I'm back! Thank You're you not dead! You know, it's very rare I ever get a cheat right, and you actually screw it up the minute I get the suicide cheat right. I'm sorry. Okay, uh, what do you want to do, mystery box or super surprise? Up to you. Can you do the box? The box is quite cool. Yes, the box is cool. Okay, here is a box. As you know, it is the mystery box. So if we just pop this here and hopefully it won't spring up. Oh, it does spring open! With a Bulbasaur inside. It's adorable! <sighs> this was from the awesome shop of awesome. It cost me eight pounds. I regret nothing! I hate my life. Okay, so... 
You'll never see him. He'll have to go there. Do you want to maybe position him so he's sit on the shoulder? Oh, yeah. He should do. He did to you before. No, he's gone. Okay, he so it's you. time for... Oh, Paula is talking to us. Hello, goodbye. Hello. <laughs> right, so... Wait, where's it gone? What? You closed it. No, the other thing. You were looking at it before. You're saying that we were going to show them? Yes. Yeah, you closed it. I refuse this. Okay. Stay down, don't move. It'll, it'll be in recently closed. Also, yeah, hi, Mum, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. <laughs> How are you? You can't reply. You're on the other end of the internet. And I'm able to type. Be there in a minute. It's just stay there, don't move. <laughs> you found it. Yes. Oh, good. We found <gasps> something. Oh, <laughs> Okay, so, today, instead of um, planning out a proper episode for you, I decided that it'd actually be a lot better to watch these adorable little kittens. Kitten live, cam. Live streaming kitten cam. And um, if I can just get that a little closer to you. Look at them! Oh! That was Becky, not me. See? <laughs> See? And they are just so adorable and... Oh, they're away! Yeah, so uh, that, oh, that's... Look! Oh, oh my, gone. the cat's gone! The cat's, the, cat, the cat's gone! Now look at the kittens! Aww... Look, they're moving! Yeah, it's alright, I like kittens, leave me alone. It doesn't make me any less manly. Of course but... not. Of course not. I hate everyone and everything. Okay. Except kittens. Yeah, I love kittens. Kittens are awesome. If you don't like kittens, go throw yourself under a bus. Kittens are awesome. They're small, fluffy, and they give you the love and attention that she won't. I can be a kitten. <laughs> kittens don't do that. <laughs> Yours does. What? Tiggy. <laughs> I was uh, about to say, what have you been doing to Tiggy? Uh, okay, so anyway... Just like last time, because technically it's not editing if I do it after the video's uploaded. Ha. You can always check, email me at... <clears throat> Where did I do this one last time? Uh, above you, I think. Okay. You can always email me at unedited at hotmail.co.uk um, If you know any good living, live streaming things... Maybe where I can... puppies. Puppies would be good. Yeah, puppy cam. I'd love to see a puppy cam. Not confused with the puppy cam that is people's tits but you know puppy cam um send me the link or if you've got anything you want me to talk about or you know any random crap or kittens kittens, kittens 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 send us pictures of kittens cute kittens and we will show them on an edited and becky will probably go oh and then my brain will melt and you'll uh, make girly noises and embarrass yourself in front of the whole internet um, if you want to go to my YouTube channel, you can always go to W, wait, if I just point at Becky's boobs here, www.youtube.com forward slash red TV 89. You can always check out my other vlogs and stop wiping my thing. So you can check out my vlogs, my short films and other little things that I've done there. It's cool. Go check it out. It's awesome. Um, you can always go to Chris's channel if you want to check out his stuff, which is just here, which is www.youtube.com forward slash Mad Earth. Mad Earth? Mad Earth. You'll be able to it's, read it. It's, it's <laughs> right here. It's in my hands, people. Just read what is here. Right here. Not going anywhere. Just take a minute to memorise that one. There's that one. Because we can't. This one. That one. This one is right here. Come on, people. My tits are actually quite awesome today. I don't know if you can see that. It's a meerkat playing guitar. Meerkat playing guitar. Coolest thing ever. Yes, it's a kid's shirt. Okay. Um, also, you can always go to my Twitter and follow me and my updates, which I never really update because I'm lazy. But you can follow what I'm doing there and I'll tell you things and like I'm taking a shit or if I'm playing Daisy, things like that. And that will or be... both at the same time. Yeah. And that is right here above Becky's head. Right here, look. My hand's going through it. Seriously, how can you people miss these kind of things? So there's one here, one here, one here, one here. And there's nothing here. But there is something here. Here, here and here. But nothing here. 
Yeah, there's nothing there. No. So until next time, this has been Unedited with me, Jason Red, And me, Becky. Saying, remember, there is nothing here.